We're glad you're with us on this Friday edition of Take 5 at The Journey. And uh, I want to share the scripture with you about when Peter, in the book of Acts, had this vision. He had this vision that to go and to tell the uh, those people that were actually unclean in that day. And, uh, you know, sometimes people think um, dreams, visions, hearing something, one little word is very much, I want to say this to you, one word from God can change your whole life, point blank. It's changed my life. Peter here received this vision, and here's what in uh, Acts 10 verse 13 says, then a voice came to him, rise Peter, kill and eat. And Peter said, not so Lord, for I've never eaten anything that's common or unclean. And the voice spoke unto him again the second time, what God had cleansed, that call not thou common. And what he was saying, look, you can go to everybody now. You can go to not just the Jewish people, but you can go to the Gentiles and go tell about the Lord. I remember some years back, I was with a great pastor. He had a great imprint upon my life. I treasured those days, and man, I tell you what, I soaked it up. And he said something to me, and as he was praying for me as I was departing to go down here to Georgetown, he said, the Lord's going to give you, and you're going to have a great effect upon the bluegrass region. Well, you know what? You know what that little thought did? It just stuck in my heart. God, you're, you call me to the bluegrass. You call me to touch this area. And that little thought, here's what it did for me in the ministry. It took me out of being a neighborhood church into an area church. I wasn't thinking small, but I was thinking what God wanted me to do. And that little thought, it triggered so many things. You know, I was on radio five days a week, twice a day. We were on channel 27, and you know, where it would reach all central Kentucky and eastern Kentucky and even parts of West Virginia. And uh, you know, it had such a great impact because it was that thinking, those little thoughts, those little words, those little things. They're not sideline deals. They're not accessories. They're, they're like the steering wheel in your car. You can have air conditioning or not air conditioning, but you gotta have a steering wheel. Steering wheel is essential. There's vehicles without air conditions. Why you'd buy one, I don't know, but it's not a necessary thing. And so, I just want to say this to you. Treasure, those little words, those little things, those little phrases. Man, one word from the Lord will turn your life upside down. Uh, I want you just to ponder those things. Think upon those things. Don't shove it off as being minute. But consider it very, very important if you're going to make it spiritually. Well, I love you. I want you to say to yourself this day, God is a good God, and the devil's a bad devil.